In October last year, the ship MV Rushcutter sank in Darwin Harbour. She is now beached below the high water mark at East Arm in Darwin Harbour and is now owned by our NT not-for-profit registered association, Save Motor Launch 1321 Inc. During the Second World War, the Rush Cutter was commissioned as the Harbour Defence Motor Launch, naming her HDML 1321. 1321 sister ship, the HDML 1322, defended Darwin Harbour, whilst 1321 worked to our north, putting small teams of Australian Z Special Forces behind enemy lines. Many of these troops didn't make it back. The restoration of 1321 will be a memorial to those men. The HDML 1321 was built by Purden and Featherstone at Battery Point in Hobart out of Hewan Pine with BHP lead ballast at a time when we urgently needed coast watching patrol boats to our north. After the war, 1321 worked in Darwin Harbour for the Northern Territory Administrator before being sent to Sydney Harbour in the 1950s where she was renamed the HMAS Rush Cutter. In 1956, she worked on the Olympic Yachting Regatta on Port Phillip Bay in Melbourne. She was decommissioned from the Navy in 1971 and had many lives before finally making her way back up north where she was a cruise boat out of Newlandboy in East Arnhem before returning to Darwin Harbour in 2016. We are the Pearl Harbour of Australia and Darwin is the Navy patrol boat capital of Australia and 1321 is at the heart of our military history. In honour of the fallen and those few still standing, we are trying to save and restore 1321 to a World War II configuration which will become a centrepiece of the nationally significant World War II tourism experience in Darwin, but we need your help. The rust cutter must be moved to dry land for restoration. The US Marines are helping to remove the lead ballast to make it easier to lift, but we desperately need to hire a very large crane and truck to move her to the Paspali shipping yard for restoration. 1321 is the last of the Royal Australian Navy's World War II coast watchers. The 1321 is an extremely important part of Australia's maritime and military history. And she can be saved, but we're going to need your help. The fate of the HDML 1321 currently hangs in the balance, but she can be restored. And when restored, this veteran heritage ship will be the only World War II Coast Watcher patrol boat in Australia, adding to our unique military tourism offering but we need your help. For further information, go to our GoFundMe site or www.ship1321.com. Written, narrated and authorised by Robert Welfare, Chairperson, Save Motor Launch 1321 Inc. and Ship's Agent for the Vessel.